Chilling rain. Open the pack and you'll never be the same. Chilling rain. And the professor K is super lame. Chilling hey. rain. Everyone listening has now just lost the game. Chilling rain. <laughs> That is too good. What is up, everybody? And here, and it is finally my turn to open up some chilling rain. How long have you had that song memorized? Weeks. <laughs> weeks. I have been wanting to do that for weeks. The fact that you said everyone listening has lost the game. Wow. That's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. A plus. <laughs> Thank you so much. My ears are bleeding. <laughs> My ears bleed. <laughs> Let's see if all right, all right. So with that out of the way, like I said, this is gonna be my first time opening up a box of Chilling Rain. And now, honestly, this is a set that I have underestimated at first. But now, honestly, this set is amazing. There's so many cool things to pull, both competitive and for collector-wise. And let me let me know what y'all think of the song. Alright, so let's put that aside. My first pack of Chillin' Rain on the channel. Let's do this. We got Rapid Strike Inkai. Rapid Strike, can you dig it? Score a bun bun single strike. Shoop it single strike. A cut up a foo. We got the nasty lady I don't like. We got Brawly, not Broly, Brawly. Totally different. We have Haunter, a reverse hollow blitzel, and an Emperus. Very nice. Very nice. But yes, it took me a while to get that song in my head. It was. Yee. That was better than half the music that comes out today. Oh, burn! <laughs> Thank you so much for that. All right, second pack here. We got Clubapus, Grookey, Schnazel, got a Weedle, uh, Galarian Farfetch. Sharpening his leak. We got Scroll of the Skies. Dynatree Hill, which I believe this is why we have the Galarian Bird Trio. It's because the fruit of this tree, even though it's never explained, there's gotta be some reason why there's Galarian Birds, and I think it's because of the fruit of this tree. So we got Steeny. A reverse rare wall ring. Okay, second pack in there. We got a rainbow rare. Rainbow rare doctor. Even do okay. Draw two cards. If your opponent's active Pokemon is a Pokemon V Max, draw two more cards. I feel like this card will be better as we rotate out, and V Maxes are pretty much almost every deck. But for right now, it's okay. All right. Alrighty here. That said, side for that. And we start with Grookey again! Sneasel again! Oh, we got a Rots this time. We got Hattacross, Candy Diglett, Path to the Peak, Ladian, Welcoming Lantern, a Reverse Hollow Haunter, and we got a Bomb of Snow! Man, it'd be really cool to pull some alt arts here. I thought the birds or the Calyrexes. Oh, oh, and a Zara Aura. Honestly, pulling any alt art would be really cool. <coughs> pull a pull off for me, please. I'll do my best, Jables. I will do my best. All right, so we got a Deerling, got a Delibird, La Vesta, Marie, Head Across, Old Cemetery, Raboot! We got Agatha. A reverse hollow spiral energy. Very nice. And we got ourselves Galarian Surfetched. Surfetched, Galarian Surfetched. Right, 
put that side here. Let's keep on going. Let's keep the train going here. We got Delibird, La Vesta, Marie, Patacross. Oh, okay, those were like identical stuff. Clavapus. We got Galarian Chestplate, Lucky Energy, Flampy, a Reverse Rare Grapple Lock, and a Wall Rain. Very cool, very, very cool. All right, so. Believe it or not, guys, I actually did open up my own personal box of Chilling Rain, and I got some pretty cool stuff out of it. Like, I was able to get both a Full Art and a Rainbow Rare uh, Melanie back-to-back. -back. I got two out of the three birds of the set. I got Zapdos and I got Articuno. I did not pull a Moltres. Go figure out the one I would like to use for my Eternatus deck. I was not able to pull. I'll probably just end up buying some Moltres. Because, like, Eternatus is one of the very few card decks. Well, yes, technically cards, but decks I actually have IRL. We got Single Strike Urshifu and a Hollow Beedrill. Okay, I actually want to talk about these. I actually want to talk about these too. So there's the Single Strike Urshifu and the Rapid Strike Urshifu Stage 1s that we got in the set. And they actually have some potential. Like this one here, Fist of Strife for 2 Dark and a Color. It's 100 and this has any damage counts, so it's 100 more. So this really works with not only the Single Strike Energy, but the Houndoom as well to attach it. And then you just give it 20 damage and... You're doing like 200 plus. So let's say you have damage counters on it from the Hound Dune and you attach like two single strikes and dark to him. That's 240 you're doing for just like, for a stage one, one prize attack, you're doing 240 damage. So that's quite good. And B Drill. Persistent Sting is the attack people are talking about here. Is that if your opponent's active Pokemon has any special energy, it is knocked out for one grass energy. Just auto knockout. Insane. That is absolute craziness. Yes, what I understand, there are quite a few waifu cards in this set, as the chat is saying. There's a lot of waifu stuff in this set. Alright, so we got a bounce suite. Lapras, Blitzel, Aaron, Deerling, Drizzile. We got Peony, Caitlyn, a Reverse Hollow Weedle, and a Metagross, our first regular V. Very nice. There, put the rest back. Alright. Honestly, for me, it seems to be difficult to pull anything Calyrex. Is that in my entire personal box? I didn't even get a regular Ultra Calyrex, not even just the basic types. I like two or three out of one of And yet, I've got none. Alright, so we got ourselves a club of puss. Test form. Atena. Aeron. We have Ralts. Celio. Cato Celio. And there's one of the guards. One of the guards. One of the cards y'all in the chat are talking about. We got Cybol. A reverse Curlia. And oh! I pulled an alternate art, but it's Galarian Slowking. But you know what though? Slowking is cool. I don't have an issue with Slowking. Oh, that's cool. Slowking I have no issues with. But you know what? I'm just glad to pull an alternate card. You're tough to pull. Mm-hmm. Arguably tougher than like the secret stuff. Mm -hmm. But I think that's gonna be it as far as like the full arts and the secrets go for the set. Surprised I got them this early. But you know what? You never know with Pokemon boxes. You absolutely never know. And speaking of which, like, um... Not only for, like, collector stuff, but there's a lot of competitive potential in this. Like, both Calyrexes are good. So I did mention earlier I underestimated this set. Like, the both the Calyrex decks are good. You've got the Blaziken VMAX with Zara Aura. The two Urshifus are pretty good. Like, and honestly, the Gardevoir Gallade here is not a bad thing going for it either. And this, I don't know what this is going to do. But, like, this whole cast form thing is another deck here. Reminds me of the, um, of the Rotom deck we got in, like, one of the Sun and Moon sets. I don't exactly remember which one it was. But that's what it's reminding me of. 
Reverse Weeding Gloves. And we got a Tornadus V. Not bad at all. If I'm, like, missing any decks from Chilling Rain... Oh! Oh, and, um... Not really a deck, but just, like, a, a huge boost to Eternus with Moltres. With a Glary Moltres being Libris. That's another one I can mention. But other than that, if I've missed any decks that you guys are either looking forward to or you guys think could be, like, competitive, let me know in the comment section down below or let me know in the chat. Ew! And we got a Hollow Running Wrist, but EW! All right, we're almost done with our first half of the box. I mean, okay, I guess I also did kind of forget. I'm actually not sure where Santa Con is going to be. It is an interesting one for sure. Honestly, it's just really hard to say where bench stuff is going to be at the moment because Mew is in fact a card. But honestly, once rotation happens, it's open season. Unless they reprint another bench berry, which I honestly doubt they'll do. I severely doubt we'll be getting another bench barrier card anytime soon. Four, one, two. This side. Ba -ba 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 Try to make white team melody viable. Oh, there's no trying about it. Like, that's a very good card. Especially once rotation happens and we lose Welder, Melanie's going to be the next best thing. So, there's no trying about it, J-Wolf. It's going to happen. So, we got a Coughing. That's another That's another interesting one I forgot. I forgot the Weezing and Galarian Weezing. Apologies, I did forget about that one. Got Shuppet, Squabbit, Spoil. Got Swirlix, Old Cemetery, Raboot. We got Agatha. Reverse Hollow Galarian and Slow King. Go figure the thing I pulled an alternate art of. And we got a wall wall ran. I feel like I'm getting a lot of those. Alright, on the side. Got a Venipede! Snowbad! Ew! Brawler, Snow Runs, Crabominable, Duck Tud, the one that's not the Rainbow Rare. We got a Lady in, a Reverse Guruki, and a Bomb Snow. Lucas, why do you hate me? I guess this set is now called Chilling Wall Rain. Ha! <laughs> nice. What are you doing back there, bud? All right, so we got beep beep. I'm a Marie. We got a Ralts. We got a Rainy Cast Form. We got Snowbird, Galarian Yamask, Cybold, Laron, Expedition Uniform, a Reverse Hall of Furfru. That's actually cool to see this because, to my knowledge, we have not had a Furfru card in a long time. And we got a Volcarona Rare. But come on, I want to pull a Calyrex card. Calyrex and Moltres. You give me one of those, I'll be happy. Yep. Alright, so we have for Brawler, Grookey, Scorbane, Aeron, Snorunt, Kakuna Matata, Flannery, Rugged Helmet, Reverse Justified Gloves, and another Hollow. This is actually only our third Hollow. We got Tauros. Alright, so this is the last pack for the first half. I mean, it's fair, Lucas. We always want the pulls here. Yeah, we get one. Always on about the pulls. Yeah, if we don't get a pull in these blocks, that would be okay. It's okay. Now we got Blitzel, a Quillfish, Weedle, Yuck, Diglett, Celio, yes. Melanie, Whirlypede, Reverse Hollow Bounce Sweet. Hey, there we go, Galarian Moltres. It's the regular one. Honestly, it, it even though it's not the full art or the gorgeous alternate art, I I still like this yeah, Moltres. The, the is really yeah, it is. Um, matter of fact, Lucas, I believe, actually in one of his packs pulled the alternate art Galarian. Wait, 
Hold on. Oh snap! There was a pack hiding behind. There was a pack hiding behind that box. Okay. That's hilarious. Okay, now I guess this is the final card for the first that half. Funny. That is funny. I can't believe I would have missed that. It was like, it was like, you can't find me. All right, so we got Rainy Cast Form. We got a Larvesta, Sobble, Ladybug, Quovet, Karen's Conviction, Weeding Gloves, Porygon 2, Reverse Hall Laron, and we got a, we have a Rapid Strike Zangoose. Ooh, this one has a lot of text. 50 damage, you play a rapid strike sport from your hand during the turn. This attack also does 50 damage to two of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Hmm. It's not bad. It's like a bad box. Buddy, this is not a bad box. We have not. Buddy, have you not been paying attention? We got way more than just one pull. I would, li I would like to have more pulls, yes, but. I, I think we'll be okay. We got the reverse the wacky and we have a Malamar. Oh my goodness. This is also another one I forgot to mention. A lot of people were actually talking about this Malamar deck here. But a Rapid Strike Tentacles. You reveal Rapid Strike cards in your hand. Not Pokemon. Rapid Strike cards. It does 40 for each one you revealed. And then you shuffle them all back in the deck. So that's another that's another kind of deck that is being talked about right now. So like, there's so many decks in this set being talked about. I know. I know, right, Devin? Leave that alone. Remember that sunshine's, buddy. There. So we're going to start here with a spell. Atena. Rock Roof. Shuppet. Cast Form. Agatha. Fog of Crystal. Peonia. We have Reverse Steamy. Ooh, and we got ourselves a Volcanian V. I'm not sure if people are talking about the Volcano. They may or may not be. I've not. I personally have not heard anything about the Volcano yet. But who knows? No, you haven't. No, no, you haven't, Lucas. You lie. No, I'm not lying. I totally not. You lie. I'm telling you that. All right. Next pack here. We got ourselves Prebrolla. We got Gorlet. Porygon. Rookie, Beep Beep Marie, Thwacky, Porygon 2, Echoing Horn, Reverse Hollow Tapu Fini, and we got a Hollow Frost Last. Nice. Yeah, that's nice. That is very nice. We could. Yeah, we could. We absolutely could. And then that's going to be like. What do we have here? Alright, so we got ourselves Cast Form, a quail fish, Ralts, Heracross, Cast Form, Fire Resistant Gloves, a Welcoming Lantern, Raboot, a Reverse Step Striker, and Ooh! So I got both the Moltres and Calyrex, so I did. I did want to pull one. So this is the Shadow Rider V Max Calyrex. Now this is Arguably the most hyped card of the set. And like everything about it's really, really good. So Underworld Door, once during your turn, you may attach a psychic energy from your hand to one of your bench Pokemon, and then you get to draw two cards afterwards. So that's really amazing right there. And Max Geist for three colors energy, 10 damage, and does three more for each psychic energy attached to all of your Pokemon. So the damage can add up really quick. I would say it's only weakness is that it takes a little bit to get them big numbers. Well, two weaknesses. That and it is weak to dark, which Eternus is still looking very strong. E even with the fighting going around, Eternus is still a very strong deck. So that's something has to worry about right there. But other than that, it's an amazing Wait, card and an amazing deck. Like a, a Pokemon not dark, it might have a dark. It might end what? What? That's the video game, buddy. I'm talking about the card game. That those are different. I get what you mean, though, buddy. But that really more applies to the video game. We got impact energy, reverse Swirlix, and a Kecleon. 
I mean, like when they beat the tournaments. I think Pekion is like. I don't even. Nobody talked about that. Card. Yeah, I don't. It's an interesting card. Yeah, I don't it's think funny. it's. I don't think people have been talking about it. Yes, it can be. I, I think so. Got a Snowvert, Gross. We got a Crabrawler, Snow Runt, Weedle, Spiral Energy, Peony, Hilaron, Reverse Hollow Ghastly, and a Full Art Sandaconda V. I didn't even think we were going to get a Full Art since we got the Ultimate Art. All right. That's pretty cool. I legit did not think we were going to get a Full Art. I, I see Grove, Blue Grove. I was extremely happy to see that. I already did get Santa Conda. <laughs> Got Schneisel, Heracross, Rookie, Golette, Deerling. Got Spiral Energy. Got a Honey, Avery. Oh, sweet Oh, you have Sweet Victories playing. Shoot, I wish I could see who did that. I missed who did it. I'm so sorry, but thank you so much for the bits for the Sweet Victory. And here's the Galarian Weezing. This is the one that goes with the regular Weezing. So its ability is that each dark energy attached to your Pokemon that have Weezing in their name provides two. So... So Galarian Weezing does that, and the regular Weezing is a Dark Pulse for 20, and does 20 more for each Dark Energy, which doesn't seem that powerful, but we add it on with this, it's really 40 for each energy, so it adds up quick. Yee! I'm calling you're going to be pulling a Blazik and Alternative Art. Jables, if I'm able to pull two alternate arts in one box, that would be like the most busted box ever. Do you know what? Let's see. All right, we got a Grookey, Bun Bun, Aaron, Snow Runt, Venipede, Old Cemetery, Steeny, Dynatree Hill, a Reverse Cup Foo, and we have a Bomb of Snow. We already pulled the Rainbow Rare, buddy, which is a secret rare, so I don't think so. No, no, I know it's in the set, but we already pulled our secret rare, so I'm not sure we'll be pulling another one. The golden one. Alright, so we pulled Deerling, Galadelli Bird, La Vesta, Marip, Clavapus, Pionia. I, I am butchering that pronunciation, I'm sorry. Fire Resistant Gloves, Crabomnable, or Reverse Passimian. And we got another Galarian Moltres. Nice. That's yeah. very nice, because typically Eternity's decks are running two of this, so... Uh, this was my box. I'd already have Duplicate. the cards to support it. We got duplicates. Duplicate. 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 Two, three, four. One, two. All right. So we got ourselves a Galarian Far Fetch, a Podagon. We got a Cross, Shovel, Inkai, Kalia, Fog Crystal, Brawly. Ooh, a reverse Gallade. Now, this one's kind of cool because it's got Dynablade. For two colors, that's 60 for each V Pokemon your opponent has in play. This is one of these cards that's okay now, but as time goes by where we have nothing but Vs, this is going to get so much better. And we got another Persimian. I should probably talk about the Persimian. This is pretty good, too. Throwing Coach. Rabbit Strike Pokemon attacks you 30 more damage to your opponent's Bench V Pokemon and Bench GX Pokemon before Weakness and Resistance. That's pretty cool. You can't apply more than one Throwing Coach ability at a time, though. So you can't, like, just spam these. But this really helps out the VMAX Urshibu Rabbit Strike, helps out the Zerora. Like, this just boosts so many things in it. It's a really good card. Mm -hmm. Kit card good Kit card. Not fully sure what that was supposed to mean, but I'm just gonna say thank you. Alright, so we got a Galarian Yamas. Got Kess Form, Kess Form, Lediba, Gorlet, Rabut, Agatha, Pinoia, 
Reverse Larvesta, and we got a rare Emperos. All right, I think we're due for at least one or two more hits. I meant Kafka. Ah, gotcha. Snover, Blitzel. We got Gasly, Kofang, Delibad, Paragon 2, Robot! Scroll of the Skies! Scroll of the Skies, River! So we got a Volcarona. Don't mess with the lock, buddy, okay? Well, then go. If, someone, if you think someone's really knocking, go tell. Okay. I personally have not heard anybody knock. I don't hear anybody knocking, but... Alright, so we got a cop bag, a shoot bit. Shwab it. Shwalex, spoil, peony. Resistant gloves, a fire, welcoming lantern, a reverse kecleon, and a scoliopede. I, I would like to see one more. Even if it's just like another hollow, I would like to see one more. Oh, ask and I shall receive. Like I said, even a hollow is fine. By the way, my box has two secret rooms. Oh, shoot, really? So we got Gasly, Lediba, Portagon, Swellix, Sneal, Dynatree Hill, Justified Gloves. Wait, I almost had Rocket Energy. Lucky Energy. A Reverse Lapras, and a Broski Hollow! Now, this is also kind of an interesting deck for the set. So, Shining Arcana is what really makes this interesting. Once during your turn, you look at your top two cards of your deck, and you attach any number of basic energy you find there to, end to your Pokemon any way you like. And then you put the other cards in your hand. So if you don't get a Psychic Energy, you still draw two cards off of this. It's almost like Intrepid Sword for Zacian. It's two instead of three, but your turn doesn't end. So you can stack these. So it's really, really cool. And it kind of does what... um, It's another way of doing what Shadow Rider Calyrex does. And Brainwave is also not bad either. 60 damage and does 30 more for each Psychic Energy attached to this Pokemon. One thing I've been doing online for Expanded is I've been pairing this Gardevoir up with a Gardevoir from Next Destiny. It's the one that doubles Psychic Energy when it's attached. So literally two Psychic Energy on this when the other Gardevoir is out is 180 damage. Two Energy does 180. So that's really, really awesome. Hey, you know what? I'm not going to worry about those. Those are bad Pokemon, so it's okay if they fell down. Don't put them back up, Lucas. They're still back. Oh, we got another one. Another one. They're already back. All right, so we got the Mari, the Pelotes, Pestform, Schnover, Yamask, Down a Tree Hill, Spiral Energy. We get the Laron, the Reverse Weezing. So the Smog Burst. Okay, it's Smog Burst, but it's basically Dark Pulse. 20 and 20 more for each Dark Energy attached to all your Pokemon. That's the one you pair up with the Galarian Weezing. So it's really more like 40 for each energy. And we got a Tornado's V. I'm pretty sure we already got one of these. So like the Moltres, I believe this one's also a duplicate. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Let me look quickly make sure I'm not Yo, Okay, no, I'm not a liar. This is our second Tornadus. Duplicates. Duplicate. Doop, doop, duplicate. Doop, 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 doop. This is our last three packs. Got a far through. Can you diglet? Larvesta. Inke. Rock rough. Path to the peak. Impact energy. Drizile. A reverse hollow quill fish. And a bonnet. There. Second to last pack. Can we get lucky? Can we get one more pull? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Ugh! Yes. No, that is not a yes. That's a no. Final pack. 
if we get both of these, yeah, uh, uh, I'm just gonna fan it. So with the spirit tomb and the squabbit. Squab it, shove it. Yeah, Why are you so mean to squab it? Uh, Daddy called him that as well. What did squab it ever do to you? <laughs> That's what we call him. That's what we call him. That's no good. Doesn't you organize everything? I'm sorry. So not a bad box. I pulled quite a few things I wanted to pull. So for our hollows, we got the Broski, the Frostlass, the Tauros, the Galarian Renungrius, and we've got Beedrill. For the Vs, we got two Moltres. Perfect number for my turn is deck. Go figure. That's the amount you're supposed to have. We got two Tornadus. Volcanian. Got Metagross. Candyglove do a spin around me. No, we cannot. We got the Shadow Rider, Calyrex V Max. We got a full art Sennaconda. We have the alternate art Galarian Slow King. And we got the Secret Rare, Rainbow Rare Doctor Supporter. Yep, that's 10 seems to be about the standard for this set. Honestly, ten, I even because like my even my personal box had 10 too, so I I'm still 10 for 10. <laughs> so that's definitely cool. From what I understand though, this is a gigantic set. Which is both good and bad. But anyways, so hope you guys enjoyed that video. I'm glad I finally got to be part of a Chilling Rain video. And I hope you all liked the little song I did. I know a lot of you did. It's okay. But with that, I hope you all have a fantastic day. And I'll see you all next time.